Stop pushing me. I am trying so hard to be nice, but you keep provoking me. The former minister of advocate and director of news media for the ruling All Progressive Congress, APC presidential campaign council, Fermi Fane Kaidi, one such people to stop pushing them before they make him to unleash a hellish storm against the principal and candidate. While speaking on his decision to support Bola Tadambu presidential ambition, the outstanding politician Fermi Fane Kaide made it known that he will never apologize for the position he took concerning the Bola Tadambu and Kashim Shetima, adding that he does not care if Nigerians are happy or comfortable with this decision. FFK post on Twitter read thus, I am trying so hard to be nice and gentle, but you keep provoking me. Stop pushing me before you make me unleash a hellish storm against your principal and candidate. I will never apologize for the position I took concerning Tunumba and Shetima and those that are not comfortable to it should go and should go okay, should go. I am trying so hard to be nice and gentle, but you keep provoking me. Stop pushing me before you make me unleash a hellish storm. Well, at this point, FFK. Then they talk this thing. Uh. FFK, then they talk this thing. FFK, who cares about your decision to support who? You have traveled out of Nigeria. Yourself, your family, your relations, your friends. They are all suffering in, in you. They are all suffering. In, in, they are all suffering here because of what you put us into. Your hellish storm can do Nigerians more than what your wrong position is already. Okay, what can your hellish storm can do to Nigerians more than what your wrong position is already doing? One thing I know is that God passed all of you. We are actually waiting for you. Useless hellish storm, which has handed you nothing but often made you a political beggar, seeking for appointment soon to catch after election when you could as well contest but or won't for obvious reasons. Your hellish storm only makes you the husband of several women like the servant of the Bible. God knows that you dissipate your energy vigorously in seeking. God knows what you dissipate your energy vigorously, seeking in between the legs of a woman while your political peers are contesting for office or the other. You only come for them to appoint you in the office. Shame unto you, Mr. Hellish Storm. Shot fired you. Shot fired. FFA, who cares about your decision to support who? family have traveled out of nigeria yourself your family your relations how suffering and what it put us into your holy storm can do to nigerians okay i think i've said this before i want to be like people being politics humble and incorruptible happy peaceful and spartan in nature we know why you you know why you supported bola Tarimbu. you did because of corruption case hanging on your neck mountain to billions of naira you know peter b would have fought against corruption and most of you by now may not have been wearing might have been wearing the prison dress but it's not over yet anybody alive or dead who was stolen from a common world will forfeit it animal like you looking for favor basket small then saying that so your father been they do like chameleon i beg me for not leave me they don't start again can't you mention the principal and the supporters are you afraid to say it out this is how a coward talks all the time and if you're referring to bidding family we will teach you a lesson you will never forget in your life. <laughs> oh my goodness. You're barely speaking, not you. Please, quiet and let us hear what. What will you do now that you have not done before? Femi Fane Kayudi, FFK indirectly, we all know what you and your co paymasters can do. And that will never take Nigerians by surprise. The worst thing that can happen to a man is for him to come out and he does not have integrity. The worst thing that can happen to you is for when you people when you come outside go talk, people go talk say, uh, I beg you leave this one. You think this one they talk? You understand? People are quick to dismiss whatever you have to say because of what they don't see you do in the past. I don't know about you, but I don't think it's a nice thing. I don't think it's good that you come and people dismiss you, Ken. What this one saying? This one will be say. If they give us so 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 amount now, nah, you go stop the talk or you go stop. You understand? You understand me? There is nothing as wrong as as in there's nothing, not just wrong. You know ramifications could die. It's not okay. 
You are indirectly imploring for appointment. Who cares about your your narrative that after eating so much from the trash site, you start feeling important? I don't know you and Asari whose mental illness need more serious attention because you both lack shame and like so-called Nigerian leaders talk. Tunembo has long a time rejected you for your support. No political appointment for you can find solution to your mental ill health. Femi, you're mentally unstable. Like I said, part of one of the things where people use no FFK and I say they don't really regard what they talk. You know, get integrity. And like I said, a man, I don't know about even the woman, what am I saying? A woman said, no good like, make you come outside, make you come the talk, make people come the, you know, make people come, come outside. They're not going to regard what you did talk. I mean, it's painful if you ask me. It's really, really painful. No matter how you look at it, it is so painful. Painful that you come outside and, you know, if you talk, people no not want even listen to what you won't talk at all. Okay. Apart from your wife, who can you be to unleash anything on? Be expecting an appointment from the same Tunumbu you called the drug lord in year 2020. He did not just call Tunumbu a drug lord. If you read up all the atrocities this guy said about Tunumbu, when I, when I heard that he had started supporting Tunumbu, I was shocked. I was shocked to the bone marrow. Because if you read up all the atrocities this guy unleashed about Tunumbu, as in, if now you, if ain't go ask himself, say, if not me, safe go see, I go even, I go forgive myself. If read up what he read about Tonumbu, Tonumbu no na. He knows. Very pity that after you had lies against the evils, your boss still sidelined you on sharing process. I don't even know that you are still around. I thought I've left Nigeria with annoyance. Very, very pitiful. Your shame, even they shame me. If you can deny your children because of election, because of what we eat, how can every any reasonable human take you serious? Nice for who? Go ahead and talk now. Iranians lost their president in bad way, crashed, a big disgrace and painful death that a bad man deserved. He slaughtered 100 people in Iran for nothing. Talk now, free now. Nothing will resemble about what they said before. Fire won't watch. Please go let the fire catch among them. They are the ones that have sowed, sowed the seed of discourse in this country. Hmm. Alright, on this note, you have come to the end of the news. So thank you for turning in to listen until I come your way next time. Enjoy the rest of your day.